Tyler, I'm really sorry to tell you this, but uh, your test results came back for your exam, and it turns out that they are positive. I am really sorry to tell you this, but your test results for your prostate cancer exam have come back positive. You have cancer. Repent! For his coming is near! Come one and all! For he is coming soon! Believe in your hearts! Believe! Coming soon! Read the words and make you, sir! Do you believe in the words? No, I'm sorry, I'm a non-believer, sir. A non-believer? No, tragic! No, read his words. Uh, no, I've already, will uh... will save your life! I've already read them, sir, actually. Have you read them? Yes, really? quite in fact, So I you have. must believe, right? No, I don't. No, I'm, you have to! I'm not a believer. I told you that already, sir. I don't believe in what God, is... Christ, the Holy Trinity, any oh, of it. No, sir. You must believe. What is your name? What is your name? My name is Tyler. Tell me, what do you believe in, Tyler? Nothing. Nothing? No. Not even the words of Christ? Not even the words. Not a religious person. Have you read the words of Christ? Yeah, I have, actually. Oh, then you, you must believe in it. No, not quite. Uh, just uh, take it kind of metaphorical. You know? Metaphorical? No, it must be taken literally, Tyler. My favorite passage in this Bible. Leviticus 18.22 He who shall lie with man shall burn in hell. Do you understand what that means, Tyler? The gays shall burn in the pits of hell. My dad's gay, fucking asshole. No, 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 no. It is not me. It is him. Oh, yeah. He has directed us to live this way. Yeah. The guy upstairs, right? Yeah, the, yes. You he understand. Gay people shall burn in hell. Correct. And those who do not believe... that women should be beaten by their husbands? Yes, that, that as well, but also... Or that the fact that a man lets his wife, children, own livelihood be perished okay. to waste All right. as a sign okay. of obedience. Tyler, okay. What kind of God are you forcing upon me? Huh? Oh, yeah. Yeah. All okay. right, yeah. Fuck you, think you talk. I get it. You're a sinner. You can, you can shoot. Okay. You can walk away. All right, fuck you. Yeah. Don't tell me. Don't, All right. don't tell me what my afterlife's gonna be, or yeah. anybody else for that matter. Now you listen here. He who does not repent or accept is not getting afterlife. Goodbye. Repent, for he is coming soon. Three is. sure are rude making me stand underneath a crooked tombstone that's got a crack going through it. How's that rude? Could crush me to death. Uh, that's my business, you know. Oh, you work here some? <laughs> Not quite. No. In a cosmic sort of a way, maybe. What? 
I am Death, at your service. Tyler, nice to meet you, Death. I'm well aware. You have a very bad prostate cancer problem. Yes, I've heard all about you, Tyler. I'm very sorry. But, uh, I'm here to ease your transition into the afterlife. Afterlife? What are you talking about? You've passed away. No, what? Yes, you're dead. No. I'm sorry. No. It's my job to tell you. Listen, I've been doing this for a way longer time than you can even comprehend. You just, just believe me. You're dead. I'm sorry. The cancer killed me? Yes. Now, uh, if you have any questions before, uh, I send you on your merry way, ask them now because I'm the only guy in this place honest enough to answer them earnestly. Uh, uh, what's next? Well, you will go onwards through the gates and you will meet a god. A god? Yes, there are plenty of them. Not sure which one. I hope you chose the right one to believe in. Um, but if you didn't, I'm very sorry. It's not really my fault, Tyler. I'm just kind of a middle manager around here. I have no say in the matter. If it were up to me, I wouldn't kill anybody. It's a very disappointing and very uh, depressing undertaking, if you don't mind the pun. I'm very sorry. On you go. That way. Good luck, Tyler.